Grant, do you think you'd have been closer to the top six if Alex had been fit for that first portion of the season? I don't know. I can't um, you know, read the past or tell you what's going to happen, but um, you know, certainly where I, where I fit Alex Pritchard, I think your your team's always going to have more quality in it. Are you getting a sense for the, the uh, defensive line, the defensive way that's going into the team, is getting back to that sort of impenetrable run? Of earlier in, in the season, I know you weren't a part of that because literally just as you came in, wasn't it? But are you getting that sense? No, I think so. I think I think um, you know, the more people play together, and especially you know, in, in the in the back line in defence, um, you know, the more relationships build. Um, you know, the more used to you, you get to each other. Um, so no, I think we're um, you know we're feeling a bit more comfortable at the minute, and we're you know we're starting to move forward. Chris touched on it and you spoke to him about it, but we obviously expected the rest to be fully involved this year. He hasn't been, so that sort of captaincy has been with, with Evo and you've obviously had that at Blackburn. So, like, as Chris said, have you kind of felt that you can develop and, and talk more and, and be one of those captains, if you want, on the pitch now? Um, not really. I mean, I don't think there's any things that would change. Like I said, naturally, I would. the more you get used to your teammates and the more you... You know, you, you know people, the more you'll talk, but and I think that's just something that comes naturally to me anyway. Like I, I like to organise, I like to talk in the park. I guess we probably focus more on captaincy and armbands, don't we? Yeah, no, I know, I know that, but that's you know, it doesn't mean anything to me. Just finally, uh, January, is it... Is it unsettling as players? No. Not you know obviously some, some players will move, but they might be your teammates, and you never quite know if everyone around you is still going to be there next week. No, definitely. I mean, it's it's easy to say focus on, you know, the football and um, all the other stuff with transfers and things like that. Um, you know, try and put that to your back of your mind. But you know, it's that it happens, and players players come and players go. Um, but I think as professionals, um, you know, as I've I've got to focus on on their job, and their job is working hard for the club and. Um, winning football matches, um, and to be fair, I will say that here the lads are, you know, they end out to come in, they work hard. So would it be fair to say that come the start of February, in a very small way, maybe this place will be a happier place because you'll know who's going to be here for the next couple of weeks? Well, well, yeah, I think so. I think so, but I don't think that's just this club. I think that's football in general, and that's just the way it is, and the way it always will be. Cheers, Carl. Thank you. Problem.